hey, where do I start? And when's the best time to start? I have a very simple answer for that. Here and now. You want to improve? You want to get better? Where do you start? You start right here. And when do you start? You start right now. You initiate the action aggressively. You go. The idea isn't going to execute itself. And the book isn't going to write itself. And the, the weights out in the gym, they're not going to move themselves. You have to do it. And you have to do it now. You got to stop thinking about it and stop dreaming about it and stop researching every aspect of it and reading all about it and debating the pros and cons of it. Just start doing it. Take that first step and make it happen. Get after it. Discipline means taking the hard road, the uphill road to do what's right. So often the easy path the easy path that calls to us to be weak for that moment, to break down for that moment, to give in to the desire and the short-term gratification. But the discipline will not allow that. The discipline calls for strength and fortitude and will. It won't accept weakness. It won't tolerate another breakdown. The discipline can seem like it's your worst enemy. But the reality is, discipline is your best friend. It will take care of you like nothing else can. And it'll put you on that path to freedom. Do you have the courage to act outwardly on what you see inwardly? Or will you die a dreamer Will you die on the verge and on the edge and in the land of coulda, woulda, and shoulda? It is far easier not to be successful. If you don't want to make waves, be mediocre. Be normal and fit in. It takes courage to be different. It takes courage to go where you've never gone before. It takes courage to get you outside of the box. It takes courage to be successful. It takes courage to win. Do you have the courage to stand there though the storms keep raging and the people get to talking and you stand there and say, I've come too far to turn around? Do you have the courage?